Hi, I'm Adam, a GIS analyst with ESRI. ArcGIS Mobile improves the way we view and interact with our maps in the field, create and manage our data, and collaborate in the field to improve data inspection and collection times. It's much easier to see our maps outdoors and to produce beautiful maps faster and easier with more data sources. We can also collaborate with our peers in the field in real time. Mobile technology is fun and it's powerful, and I'm very excited to show you the all-new ArcGIS Mobile. Let's take a look. The user interface has been completely redesigned, making it much easier for field operators to use. With touch support, you simply touch the screen and interact with the map. Viewing a map like this outdoors can be challenging. Let's take a look at a few enhancements that make our work in the field much easier. We can dim our base map features. So here, I can make my, the features that I'm collection, collecting pop out and, and really be visible in the map. I can even change the entire display mode to switch from, say, a nighttime mode to a daytime mode. Now that we can see what we're doing, let's collect some features. Simply tap the screen. Let's uh, grab some graffiti points. I'll collect them using the map. I'll place it on the map. I can enter in some attributes about that. I can even snap a photo from the field and attach it right here in the dialog. So here's the photo I'm looking for. We'll attach that and submit this. As soon as I submit this, everyone can access and view this data. These usability enhancements make it possible for field crews to work more efficiently and record their observations faster and easier. The next mobile enhancement I'd like to show you deals with the, the creation of mobile projects, projects like the one uh, we see here. So I'm going to open up the mobile project center and I'm going to create a new project. You can leave this, uh, give this project a name Give it some map elements. I'll choose uh, from my base map options. We can uh, load in a street map data source, a cached map service, one of our own map services, and we can even connect with ArcGIS Online free or premium services. Let's bring in the ArcGIS Online street map data source to serve as our base map here. I'm going to select the street map world 2D and add this in as our base map. I also need to set a, uh, or add a layer that we want to collect, points that we're going to collect in the field. So I'm going to connect up to our server and add our collection information. And there we go. We've just created a mobile project. I'll save my changes. And to access this for our mobile field crews, it's very simple. We'll open up the mobile application. Let's open up a new project. I'll download a project from my server. Let's list all the projects that are available. We'll choose the one that we just created called Austin. And now I'm ready to go. We'll download our data. And I'm ready to start collecting points in the field. And that's it. There's our mobile project. The last application I'd like to show you is my favorite. It shows how we can use ArcGIS Mobile to collaborate in real time uh, directly from the field. So not only can I collect and maintain my own information, but I can also connect with my peers directly from the mobile application. In this case, we're looking at first responders. I can click on a first responder and see the active position of that staff member. If they've updated their profile, I can see that information here. In this case, this person is responding to an incident. And this person is on scene at an incident. I can click to view the map, and I can see their active position. And if I want, I can even communicate directly with their mobile device by email, or even text, or phone call. 
So we can see how an application like this allows us to better communicate more effectively and faster with our field crew. These mobile enhancements are going to help us all be more productive by allowing us to get our GIS into and out of the field faster and easier. Thank you.